Hello guys, my name is Victoria Pavlov. I'm the Photoshop um, artist and today I will show to you how you can apply basic um, shades to your sphere. I will be using Adobe Photoshop CC and of course I will be using my Wacom tablet. Uh, I previously created my document and also I, um, I have created my sphere using a simple um, ellipse tool. Also I have created my new folder unnamed this folder shading and here I have saved all my uh, brushes I will use today. I have uh, created my um, mid-tone brush, core shadow brush, highlight uh, brush and everything like that. Um, why I previously created my folder with all those brushes? Just because I saved my brushes with all parameters such as um, color, um, opacity, flow, and everything like that. So it will be much easier for me right now just to click on any brush I would like to use and voila. So let's start guys. Um, I will create a new layer. I will click on mid-tone brush. As you can see I didn't change anything because I um, previously created my brush with all parameters I would like to use with my uh, mid-tone shading option and I will start paint inside my ellipse just like that. I made my brush bigger just because in this way I find that it's easier to apply equal um, sh uh, shading to entire ellipse just like that. Now I will switch to my uh, mid-tone uh, 2 brush and I will continue apply applying um, shade to my sphere just like that. If I would like to merge all visible layers by the way and I will click on a lock layer right now I will paint only inside my sphere so I don't need to worry anymore if I will accidentally paint outside of my uh, sphere. So I will continue applying um, mid-tone uh, shading to my sphere just like that. And now I will switch to mid-tone 4. It will be slightly darker. And now I will uh, switch to um, Core Shadow 2. Using Core Shadow 2 brush I will apply the, darker, um, the darkest um, shade in my sphere. Just like that. Perfect. And now I will switch back to my uh, mid-tone uh, tree brush and I will continue um, applying shading to my ellipse just like that. Now I think time to apply a highlight to my um, sphere. I will switch to highlight a brush. I will make my brush slightly bigger and I will apply a highlight just like that. Now. I will switch to my, um, uh, I will create a new layer, I will click on background, I will create a new layer using um, mid-tone 2 brush, I will create cast shadow, just like that. Because light uh, comes from the uh, left side of our um, document, uh, shadow will be uh, on the right side of our document, just like that. And I will switch to mid-tone 3 and I will apply a darker um, cast shadow just like that. And I will switch now to my uh, core shadow 2 brush and then I will apply darker cast shadow just like that. How good is it? Just like that. Now I will click on my top layer. It's my sphere layer. I will duplicate it just in case. I will um, hide my first sphere layer and I will switch to my mid-tone tree brush and I will apply um, just like that lighter um, shade and I will switch to highlights brush. I will make my brush uh, bigger. I did mistake highlight just like that bigger. And just like that. And voila guys. Thank you very much. And I will see you later. Bye.